Well, um, my thoughts on this uh, presidential debate, I must say, um, I'm very surprised to a very large extent. Simply because I knew that uh, Dr. Baumia would do very well. I wasn't expecting too much from the CPP or the PNC candidate. I must say the CPP candidate surprised me with uh, uh, practical examples. But the vice president's performance, I was surprised. First of all, he could not project his voice. He kept stammering. He wasn't able to articulate most of the things he would have liked to say. And I was surprised that with regard to the fourth question, three people before him had answered what the state of Ghana's sports were, had proffered suggestions how this could be moved. And when it got to his turn, he told us in a way which I was very surprised, I would say in a very squibbish way, that he had never been to court before. And then when he was reminded, he said, oh, okay, court. I really prefer that question. I don't know whether he wasn't paying attention, whether he was asleep. But then again, where's the surprise, Ghana? The NDC have been asleep on the job for the last four years. The NDC promised us a better Ghana. I'm now giving us a better Ghana. And it's no surprise that the vice presidential candidate's performance was very, very bad. Dr. Mahmoud Baumia gave us suggestions. He told us, you cannot have inflation when we have high cost of living, where we have exchange rates very poor, where we have very poor interest rates. These correlations must show that there is single digit. But where you have one going south and the rest going north, then you know that the correlation is fake and therefore the uh, consequences will be shown accordingly.